Hi, Coach. Thanks for the time. Um, Christian was just talking about the excitement level about being one game from a final. Um, how much is that present for you? Just take us into kind of how you're approaching this game, knowing that you guys are one step away from possibly playing for a trophy. Well, that's always exciting. It gets the guys motivated. I think some of the prize money that I've heard in this tournament gets the guys excited. Uh, for us as a coaching staff, yeah, you try and, you know, fan the flames a little bit, get them really fired up to, you know, perform well or up to their level. So, you know, the guys have been good spirits. I think, you know, winning that last game against Minnesota was certainly a kind of a good shot in the arm for us because a lot of the talk was about our home form. So that gave them a little bit of energy, <clears throat> you know, Raul and Javi coming back. So I think the team's in a good way. We will now go with Jeremiah Oshan. Yeah, I know a lot has been made over uh, the, the fixture congestion that uh, League's Cup obviously contributes to. Do you pay any concern to that at all? Or is it just you want to, when you're playing more games, it means you're just doing, doing better? Uh, I, I think it's just part of our league, uh, part of our sport, whether it's a midweek versus in League's Cup, <clears throat> you know, or a midweek to go fly to Dallas to play Jeremiah. Those are the things that we're presented with, with a, as a staff, as, a, as players, as an organization. I don't think there's any more significance of it. I actually enjoy these types of tournaments. I think they're great for the league. I think it's great to measure up against you know, Liga MX teams. So our, our club is taking it very seriously. We will now go with Felipe Maqueda. Uh, thank you, Paola. Thank you, Coach Brian. Uh, my question is, um, the game against Tigres was a um, very hard game, playing one of the most uh, popular and expensive uh, teams in just in CONCACAF. Now you're playing Santos, which is a more modest uh, uh, team. Uh, is how, how important is that for, for you when you prepare your games? Is, is that uh, Sounders ready for, for this game as it was for Tigres? Yeah, Felipe, you might have insulted some Santos fans there. I mean, they're a good team. Uh, they have good players. Yes, it's a young team. You know, I know their goalkeeper is out injured, but they have a lot of good, talented, young players. They play hard. Uh, you know, I, I, I am hopeful that we can have a good performance and a good game because we will need that against a very good opponent. So, you know, whether it's Tigres, whether it's Chivas, America, Santos, you know, Atlas, whoever it is, we're going to take all these games serious. Coach, this question comes from Nico Moreno. Christian Roldan just mentioned that the team has to be aware of how Santos pressures opponents with their top players. How do you prepare your team for that? And is that the key component for the success over Santos? Well, I think the key component is to score more goals than your opponent or keep a clean sheet. It always gives you a chance to win. Yes, they are a high pressing team. But we have played against, you know, LAFC. It reminds me a little bit of how Santos plays. Uh, you know, back in the day when we went to the East Coast, you know, New York Red Bull always pressed higher up the field. So I think we have enough experience. Uh, we will obviously show the players film and have strategies in place to make sure we can bypass their pressure. But that will be one of the keys to the game. Perfect. We will go back to Jonathan Seagull. Uh, hi, Coach. One more for me, just being the Tigris game. There was, of course, a lot of intent and intensity from your team in, in meeting that moment. So how do you guys channel that again, going up against another quality Liga MX opponent? Do you just kind of take inspiration from that, perhaps, what you guys were able to show? No, I, 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 can, I, I don't need to tell you who said it. Um, but the team that's in that locker room, the team that goes out on the Lumen Field on a Wednesday, Saturday, Sunday, Tuesday, whatever, every game is important to them. Every game is like a final for them. I don't have to do much to motivate them for games. 
I know you guys can say a final is different, a you know, semi-final is different. There might be some inherent, you know, maybe a little bit of subconscious, you know, you get a little more excited for the bigger games. I agree with that. But as far as my messaging is concerned, as far as what we do out on the training field, we try and be consistent. We try and make them understand that at this club, with this organization, every single game matters. And so whoever we put out on the field has to have that within them, you know, or else they won't, they won't be at the club for very long because we're a winning club.